Today, we're going to be installing and reviewing Samsung's own S22 Ultra screen protector. So let's install it and see if it's any good. Right, first of all, take any case off your S22 Ultra and also turn the device off. This will stop the screen turning on during installation. Next, grab this installation tray and remove the protective plastic and put it onto your phone. Now, you're going to want to clean the screen. Grab the included microfiber cloth and wipe all over the screen, making sure you remove any fingerprints and oil from the screen. Next, grab the included dust removal stickers and dab them on the screen to remove any dust. Take your time with this step as you don't want to get anything trapped underneath the screen protector. Now, grab one of the two film screen protectors and remove the first tab which is in the middle of the protector. Then, you'll need to line the bottom tabs up with the cutouts of the screen protector. Once you've done this, ensure the camera is centered at the top of the protector. When you're happy, get the squeegee and move from the middle outwards until the middle is stuck down. Now you need to bend the top of the screen protector down, grab the squeegee and push it up the phone while also pushing down on the phone. This will start sticking the top half of the screen protector to the phone. Now flip the phone round and repeat the process for the bottom half. Once you've done this, please work out any bubbles with the squeegee and also stick the edges down. Work the bubbles from the center of the screen to the edges of the protector to release them. When you're happy, you can remove the protective layer and the installation frame. Now you can turn the phone back on and re-add your fingerprint. I have to say, this is one of the easiest film screen protectors that I've ever installed. The protector is ultra thin and has excellent coverage over the screen. The fingerprint reader also doesn't seem to have slowed down at all. Unlike many other screen protectors, this one does not have a dark circle over the fingerprint sensor, which allows it to look like the phone right out of the box. You can also tell Samsung have used good quality film and it does not feel overly grippy on your thumbs or finger while swiping around. Overall, a great screen protector and at a fairly low cost for two as well. Personally, I prefer glass screen protectors, so make sure you check out my favorite one in this video here. And to buy this screen protector, visit the links in the description and remember to like and subscribe for more content.